Okay. So there is a boss in the profane capital. Oh yeah, if you can give him the coal. You have two coals that you can give him. Oh yeah. Oh man, you're skipping over his heartfelt speech over the giant. I don't give a fuck. Oh shit, my bad. Yeah, he was just like, oh man, I miss that guy. It's a shame what happened to him. Wait, you mean the giant that died in that fucking... Yeah, the the, the giant blacksmith. He's just like, broke oh, bread man. together? Yeah, they, they broke bread together. <laughs> they sure. broke bread together. <laughs> okay, so the undead bone shard. Oh yeah, I gotta get to the lady. So, what, wait, actually, what other infusions did you unlock with the, those coals? That was deep. Wait. Well, yeah, I would, I would imagine, like, the, uh, it would be, let's see, what's infuse... Damn, you unlocked a lot. Whoa, what the fuck? Oh, well, let's see. What have you got? What have you got? Just pick anything and just, like... Uh, let's pick an axe, see what that goes. Uh, heavy. Already had that. 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 Uh, blessed. Never blessed. Had that. Lightning. Lightning. Chaos gem. Chaos. Whoa. Hell yeah. That's that's not bad. Not that you're ever going to use them. Simple gem. Uh, deep. Dark. Blood. blood. What's blood gem? Uh, bleeding damage. Hollow? Hollow gem. This may sound crazy, but what the washing pole does bleeding damage? Washing pole for bleed damage? No. No? I would not recommend it because bleed is just bullshit. Really? Yeah, bleed doesn't do shit. Wow. It's, it's not good against enemies. Oh. Thank God. Yeah. Because it, it takes the scaling away from the weapon just to add the bleeding effect. So it's it's not really worth it. You'd rather do the damage right up front. Can you make a refined? Or not a refined, a uh, sharp washing pole? No, you need another sharp gem. Let me look up where you can get sharp gems. Because <sighs> honestly, that was like my second option, really. <laughs> sharp, well, the washing pole? Yeah. Sharp gem. Uh... Most commonly drops from Talon and Rapier Crows in Painted World DLC. Okay. Uh, red Eye Curved Sword wielding skeletons in the Catacombs of Carthus. So, Catacombs of Carthus. Sharp Gem Farming Guide. Hey everyone, blah blah blah, intro, like, subscribe. Make sure that uh, if you like and if you like my video, make sure to give it a like and subscribe and leave a comment on how much of an asshole I am and I need to put something in my butt. Well, that was far. That was long. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this isn't this isn't really a farming guide. It's just hey, go to the catacombs of Carthus and just beat up skeletons. Touch the darkness within me. You never miss a beat. <laughs> All right.
like, what? <laughs> oh, man. I got a second breakfast for all the goofy fucks. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is not a trap. Oh, jeez. <laughs> so, it, it was Lord of the Rings versus... Um, uh, Game of Thrones. <laughs> yeah, the creator of Lord of the Rings was versus the, uh... Creator of, uh, Game of Thrones. Yeah, yeah. Oof. Wow, I'm actually am that. Wow. Yeah, it's good. It's a good sign. It's a good sign. Is, is, is that Dark Souls gameplay state, or is that Toes You Need to Play a Game state? Uh... Honestly... How close am I to a boss? Uh, pretty close, ish. Oh, okay. Really? Ish. Close, close, ish. All right, I'm gonna give a. Yeah, you just gotta. Where is just it? Just progress. Ish? Just progress. Just progress. All right. Yeah. Well, yep. all right. How about this, cause if I fight this boss one try and I die, that's it. Okay. Cool. I don't think you're gonna beat him on your first try, honestly. Yeah, I can't figure that. <laughs> Do you remember I set that challenge for you at the beginning of the Let's Play? Yeah. To beat a boss on your first try? You know what? That has gotten harder and harder as it goes by. Uh, yeah. The, nice. the closest you got was... Uh, oh, damn. Who was that guy? He was like the second guy. Hmm? Um, I see, I know where yeah, it wasn't it wasn't Idux Gunder, it was uh Oh, the Vort of the Boreal Valley. That was the closest you got. Hey, twinkling tight night. <laughs> this is very reminiscent of the deaths. Hey, twinkling tight night. I'm gonna have to jump that. Tight night. I don't wanna try that. Oh! The loose wall? No. Hmm? Yeah, no. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I try even swinging at it. I try A. I, I try everything. Okay, I guess it's not No, sure. that's that, not what I that killed. Already. dead already. Oh, where does this lead to? Uh, let's see. Let's just read the message. Uh ha ha! It's a oh. quagmire. It's actually kind of fucked up that that's the name of that character from Family Guy, and he's, yeah, <laughs> a rapist. Yeah. I don't oh, say hey, it. blooming purple moss. So this it, is like a. Poison, it's like right? his last name literally means a, a sticky situation. <laughs> Quagmire. So eight. Well, I don't know where. Can, to... can you just imagine like? Uh, just women saying, oh yeah, I got in bed with a quagmire. What a sticky situation. <laughs> Ew. Or quagmire is also, uh, it, it's, it can mean lots of things. Sticky situation or a trap, you know. <laughs> wait, wait. You, you take the point. <laughs> Mar Excuse me, man. Martini and the Rufi Colada. <laughs> Excuse me, man, but does it smell like chloroform to you? <laughs> <laughs> chloroform. Oh, God. Huh? <laughs> right? No. Does this frag smell like chloroform? Oh, oh, where's no. progress? Cause shit's everywhere. Yeah, I just I'm I'm at this point just wandering at this point. Yeah, just go. Yeah, just go. Cause back there there was nothing I could have done. I mean, there was you have you kind of have to go through the poison bullshit to progress. I have to drop down there. Yeah, you have to drop down there. But there's a staircase right fucking here. Uh, try it. I think you've been down here before, though. No, oh, wait, no, no, keep going. Do it. Because I was going to say, there's like... No, fucking do it. Just go. Do what your heart tells you. No trap ahead. It's a trap. Open up your heart, and you will see. It's going to be all right. Okay, um, never mind. This is, this is a dead end. Yeah, I was going to say, there's nothing down here. Open up your heart. It's going to be all right. <laughs> Oh god, this Sonic goddamn songs again. Them good old Sonic songs. They're all good songs. Go, 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 gotta go faster. Can you really think of a bad Sonic go song? Gotta go faster, faster, faster. This like Forces had some good songs. They're just so quiet to hear. Yeah. 
parts of the situation stuck in a middle location without any explanation. But see, that series was Japanese as fuck though. Go, go. Yeah, Sonic X, wasn't that straight from Japan? Uh, well, it was an anime, so. Yeah. Don't, 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 don't think. I don't blink. I just go, 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 go. Oh. So tell me, Shadow, what was the favorite part about your life? Being dead. <laughs> Hell no. Yeah, I mean, it's gotta be nice. My, that's an ample buzz on you, Hal. Sonic, I gotta go fast. Sonic, I gotta go You have to drop into the poison, dude. There is no escape. Go, 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 Sonic X. Gotta go fast. Copyright strike my video. Sonic X. Da, 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 da. Think that. That show actually went through some of the games. Uh, yeah, it did. I think it went through uh, the storylines of uh, Sonic Adventure 2? 1 and 2. 1 and 2? Which one was the one where Eggman blew up the moon? Uh, what? Yeah, he did. That's where the, the fucking Death Egg comes into play. Death Egg. Death Star. That's a damn <laughs> Death <laughs> No, star. right? No, it's completely original. The Death Egg is original, just like <laughs> just like all Sonic OCs. <coughs> <laughs> no, I think they definitely ripped off Star Wars. A lot of things ripped off Star Wars, though. I guess so. There are a l there's a lot of shit that rips off Star Wars. Family Guy. Family Guy. Family rips Guy off rips off everything. everything. Robot Chicken. I mean, they pretty much Family Guy is The Simpsons, but for stupider people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You're right. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> motherfucker! Woo, <laughs> yeah! That felt good. Getting out there really? spears. He was hot up there just waiting. Forever for that one <laughs> opportunity. <laughs> for See that a one motherfucker just run up the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for the one He just <laughs> Yeah, thank you. He was just sitting there. Like, yeah <laughs> Wow. That, that motherfucker did. waited. <laughs> Alright. No, that dungeon, um, I feel like I didn't really, like, do yeah, it. Yeah, there are a lot of detours in that dungeon. Yeah, that's what I thought. Not really sure if there's anything worth your while there, though. I think the are fog sure? is, like, in the light area, right? <sighs> do you ever just stay dead? No, nope, that, that dude's a skill check as well, so... Get used to him. At least he's not like those fucking Silver Knights. No, he's kind of annoying. I mean, and honestly, the Silver Knights aren't too bad, but in fairness, I I was blasting them with magic constantly. That's like your answer to everything at this point. Just one. blast everything with magic. Like, why not? Like, what is wrong with blasting everything with magic? True. It depends on personal preference. So, like, look straight ahead. I'm yeah, looking at just, the wall. Just, I, mean, I see you, but get look, look down. Look. Like, that's what fog is. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yeah. Right? No. No? No. That's just background. Mm, okay, okay. I'm not gonna lie, this kind of looks like a good thing to do with the It does. It's also, it's kind of reminiscent of the, of the deaths. Just a little bit. That's not Yeah, you remember the deaths, right? The deaths? Oh my god. That terrible fucking place, and then it... And it's like, you thought it couldn't get any worse than the deaths, and then you get to Blight Town. Ugh. I feel like Blight Town was at that part where, like, I... F was that an area? What was that one area? Fuck. Make him out! Man, I ain't doing nothing. <laughs> No, you don't do shit. Well, you want to know why? 
Because you, you guys never don't feed me. me. Yeah, never feed me. Um, Mickey, we feed you twice a day. Twice a day. Most cats don't get wet food every single day. Listen, Jim. Just a lazy cat. Basically. It's not like Frank. He's not playful. Frank's very playful. He is. He's an outdoor cat. Yeah, not that much. He's just like, yeah, I'm gonna lay here till I'm bored. <laughs> <laughs> Until I can go back to X's back of his bed. <laughs> That's probably what he was trying to do last night. Just trying to get. Trying to sneak behind the bed. Got some problems, cat. Mm-hmm. You know he got problems. <laughs> For real. Looking <sighs> ass all day. That's what it is. <laughs> the dumbest motherfucker out of all the motherfuckers, man. This cat right here. Mm-hmm. <sighs> I feel like I should heal soon, but I'm away. <laughs> okay, now watch out for that motherfucker on the roof. Oh, yeah, that's <laughs> right. <coughs> is he really swinging a giant torch? He is. Oh. What happened? Well, first, I did not know that. A torch can kill me. Oh, shit. <laughs> he was swinging the torch around. You didn't think that getting hit with fire would kill you? Love are you good? Are you okay? Love it. Live it. Live it. Alright, as soon as cat runs off, I'm gonna fill my glass up. <laughs> You're staying right here. <sighs> We're gonna cuddle. That was a bad idea. Drinking it straight. No, no I fall. Not fall. taking the ladder. Oh, that that was a bad idea. I mean, you gotta go. Don't you gotta go. You mm -hmm. can't make me. But I love That's you. Uh, I could leave. You know what? <laughs> no. <laughs> Just made himself comfy. <laughs> That's a bad roll. Ah, uh, why does he guard? Fucking hell. You don't even have a face. <laughs> <laughs> what are you? What that thing was that was sleeping that had like a fucking hand for a face? <laughs> I don't know what the fuck that was. Honestly, I would have been passing that motherfucker just purposely. So, you know Wallmasters in Zelda? Oh, jeez. Mm -hmm. uh, His true form. In the true form honestly, of the Wallmaster. I haven't really played much of Zelda. So, you don't know the hands that like come out of the walls and the ceilings that just... The you play that new one some more, though. Oh, Breath of the Wild? Hell yeah. I think the only Zelda game I actually really played... Was probably like the four something, and that was pretty much it. I just, oh, I just, the, um, I just can't. Four swords. Yeah, there you go. I just can't do open world games. What? Why? They're, I don't know. I just, they're really hard for me to get into. Okay, it's too long. I don't know. Something about open world games, just like I don't know. Like GTA or San Andreas or Saints Row. See, I never liked any of those games either. What? I guess I've always been a fan of the open world just because I play RPGs. Okay. But all of the other see, games have been see, like open even world. even the Souls franchise is kind of you know a stretch. Zelda's never really been like open world until Breath of the Wild. No, they Zelda's kind of Zelda's kind of been cool. straightforward. 
Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. Like you have been straight away from like Assassin's Creed too. Because that's mostly open world. Too. Yeah. Well, I I gave up on Origins because I got I ran into an area and got my ass kicked when I shouldn't have gotten my ass kicked. You got your ass kicked when you shouldn't get your ass kicked. Yeah, exactly. It's just like, oh, these guys, they're actually s such higher... Damn. They're such higher level than me that they don't even have a number above their heads, they just have a skull. But I'm thinking, oh, it's an Assassin's Creed game. If I stealth assassinate them, that should kill them, because that's how all Assassin's Creed games have been. No, it doesn't fucking work. In fact, it doesn't even do any damage. Because Ubisoft is trying too hard to be like other fucking games. But Zelda, though, Zelda's always an open world. Well, I feel like that was like a warning, though, mm -hmm. honestly. I wouldn't say that. Like, at that point, I would have been like, yo, that's a warning for not to fuck with motherfuckers who have a skull in their head. No, but it, it doesn't matter if it's an Assassin's Creed game. Wait, what? Yeah, it does. Assassin's Creed it, games completely it, putting skill checks in. It, it doesn't matter if it. Because it's Assassin's Creed, because, like, the stealth assassination has always been the foolproof, this'll kill anybody, no matter what. But now they put a leveling system in, though. Yeah. I want to say you're right, but at the same time, though, you're an assassin. Assassins are mostly just made or for people who are just, like, you know, get you with your pants down and shit. Exactly. So if I get this guy, no matter how higher level than he is, if I get him with his pants, with, with his fucking pants down, I should be able to kill him instantly. Mmm, in certain situations. Is that a fucking door? No, that's not. Okay. Because think about assassins, though. I'm talking. I'm thinking about, like, ninjas, honestly. That's what I've seen them, honestly. Because ninjas, they will trick... They will, honestly, they will kill you when while you're a fucking sleep. Like, that dude right there. <laughs> no, actually. Hey, don't fuck with him. Actually, I could fuck with him. Wait, my soul's actually... Uh, actually, uh, you last died when you were fighting the griffin, so your souls are not up here. Go ahead and make this water. The poison killed me. And the poison finished you off. Done. So I hit A for the fuck of God. For the fuck of God. <laughs> He's got eight fingers. He's got eight fingers on his hand. Damn, I'm gonna play the fuck out based on. <laughs> Imagine if you had eight fingers. I would not want to let. I don't want to see. I'm good with just having five. <laughs> I cannot see myself having a board. Damn, imagine galloping. Holy shit. I have never seen that attack before. Blech. Well, of course, because you're mostly just distant. I have to be up close for this shit. I mean, you do have a bow. True, but I'm already at this point already. Ugh, he's slobbering too. I don't want it. And this dude is crawling on his hands and hands. Do you like doing sumo moves on you too? No, he's just or rolling just, around. We're just, just Snorlax. In the speed of sound. Oh, damn. So close. Mm.
teleport sorcerer's staff, the best staff in the game. <laughs> Worthless to me, though. Yup. <clears throat> Unless you want to all of a sudden just start shooting some spells. <sighs> I'm getting nothing but fucking rubbish and gunpowder. <laughs> rubbish! Yeah. I'm, I'm getting nothing but garbage and poop. <laughs> Enjoy it. done. Just those those few things. Like a cab. Yeah, in the future, but right now, we can still get by with mine. Can I just grab my souls real quick, please? Let me soul man, motherfucker! Why is this dude so hard? Oh, because toxic. Yeah, if I wasn't toxic, I... <laughs> if I wasn't toxic, I'd be a better person to people. Hell no, I'm an asshole regardless. <laughs> Why am I toxic?